Vaiguji ka khalsa, Vaiguji ki fadeh. Firstly, I would like to congratulate you all on the upcoming 551st birth anniversary Gur Purub of Tar Purub of Satguru Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. For this Share Your Favourite Sakhi series with Seek to Inspire, I have been asked to share my favourite Sakhi of Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. And as you can all imagine, that is no easy feat. Simply because there are so many Sakhiya, so many lessons, so many messages that Guru Nanak Dev Ji has shared with us. And to share from that is very difficult. However, upon reflection, I have come to the conclusion that sharing the Sakhi of Guru Nanak Dev Ji's Avtar seems most suitable and appropriate for this time. And actually, it is a Sakhi that I hold quite close to my heart. Many, many, many years ago, Sadhguru Siddha Guru Nanak Dev Ji, their light was placed within the womb of Mata Tripta Ji. And at that time, Mata Tripta Ji, the radiance and the beauty and the glow that they had from that light placed within the womb shone upon many. It's noted in history that the radiance and the light shone so bright that as they would enter into any room, they would light up even the darkest of rooms. Coming close to the time of Gurbaram, coming close to the time of the Avtar of Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji, it is also recorded in history that actually the cows, they would give more milk. The children born at that time were born beautiful. The crops were plentiful. It was like the earth was rejoicing, rejoicing the King of Kings coming down and entering this realm. Now, we all know of Dol Tandai. We all know, we've all heard of the midwife Dol Tandai who helped deliver Tan Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. And as history records, Dol Tandai was the midwife of that time. Now, Dais of that time, they were quite, they were considered to have quite um, niche jobs. Their jobs, the job of midwifery at that time wasn't deemed to be a reputable job. And Dol Tandai, was blessed, she was so beyond blessed to be given the dart, given the seva of delivering Tan Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. And she records that at that time, she saw this chamatka, this miracle occur when Sadhguru Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji was born. When Sadhguru Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji was born, it is recorded in history in Sri Nanak Prakash also, that Teti Krod Devte, No Krod Deviya, the Naths, the Jogis, all of these different forces on this earth came down from their different realms to do Namishkar and provide offerings to Sadhguru Siddha Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. It's recording that they offered flowers to Sadhguru Siddha Guru Nanak Dev Ji and rubbed sandalwood on their bodies. Because for us, for some people, it may be that this special baby was born. But it wasn't just a special baby that was born. This was a Gal Purkhavahi Guru coming down and saving the world. Saving the world as we know it today. After that time, Dol Tandai went over to Mehta Kalyan Ji and delivered the news that, Mehta Kalyan Ji, you have a son. The baby is here, the baby is safe. And Mehta Kalyan Ji said to Dol Tandai, okay, so what is your payment? What would you like as your payment? And Do Tandai, the simple, humble Do Tandai, she responded, you could sell the whole of the world. You can sell all of your lands. You can sell all of your belongings, but nothing, nothing can take place of what I witnessed today, of the miracles that I've seen today. And poor Do Tandai, Do Tandai, who probably didn't receive a good salary like midwives would receive today, Paul Dol Tandai in that moment was the richest woman in the world. She was the richest woman in the world. And I think that for me is my absolute favorite Saki. When I heard that in Katha, that moment, that Dol Tandai's response was that, it showed to me, it reminded me, it signified to me, it emphasized to me the power of Satguru Siddha Guru Nanak Dev Ji, the power of Darshan. Darshan that we are all seeking today 
in today's day and age, especially with this year with the pandemic and Gurkhas closing, not being able to freely go to the Gurkha, to go and do Darshan of Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji, the light, the hope, the power that the Guru places within their Sikhs, it signifies that to me now more than any, any other year or any other time. And keeping that in mind, I hope that hopefully you're all safe and that once lockdown is lifted, we all go to do Darshan of Sadhguru Siddha Guru Nanak Dev Ji, sitting on the throne of all thrones, sitting within the Gurukas and be able to not take that for granted. And I think for me, that is my favorite Sakhi of all time. Thank you. Bye, Guru Ji Ka Khalsa. Bye, Guru Ji Ki Fateh.